what is going on everybody welcome back to another video now in today's video weather is quite disgusting outside but i am on my way to go pick up a special package from fedex because we are doing another unboxing today i cannot freaking wait you guys are not going to believe some of the stuff we have in here i believe there's five geckos in total and you guys know me i always like to buy geckos for right now like breeding right now or going to breed this season and for upcoming years or like upcoming seasons so we have a little bit of geckos for now and a few geckos for later so you guys are not going to want to miss it also there is a gecko in there that we're going to be breeding that i typically don't breed now you guys know i typically only breed dalmatian crusty geckos for the most part because that's what i like and that's what i feel like i'm pretty decent at and that's what i have a lot of but there's something in here that's gonna we're gonna expand a little bit out of just dalmatian so be on the lookout for that this is a great video i cannot wait but before we get into the video and before we start the unboxing i want to show you guys one other thing and that's going to be letting the ducks out because i have one little announcement to make about that so we will talk about the ducks and then we will get right into the unboxing all right guys so i just let the ducks out they're in there in, or they have access to their enclosure but they also have access to this well i don't enjoy the wind rain and cold they do and they even like to swim in it so I let them out they have access to their pool kind of upgraded the steps a little bit from before then they can go right into their home which like i said before that is fully predator proof obviously it's not predator proof when that door is open and there's just a fence right here but it's pretty predator proof right now as is let's see if i can get closer but it's kind of jumpy because the wind is blowing and these tarps are coming over and they're clearly jumpy All right, I don't want to freak them out anymore. So done with that. Let's get to the unboxing. All right, everybody. We have another unboxing to do. I haven't posted in, I would say, probably two to three weeks, three to four weeks. It's been a while. I've been getting a lot of things in order so I can continue to post more regularly. That way you guys are getting content at least once a week, maybe twice a week. But we will talk about that more a little bit later about some of the things that might be happening. Granted, I'm not going to tell you everything. I'll just give you some ideas. And if you guess, you guess. And I'm probably still not going to tell you. But anyway, let's get into this unboxing and then we will talk about anything else. I'm very excited for this one. This one is one of those boxes where you guys know I like to buy geckos. I like to buy geckos for right now for my business and then in the future for my business. So this one has a little bit of both. We got some geckos that are, that are going to be breeding this year. And then we got some geckos that will probably be breeding in the upcoming years. Obviously, they're not going to be breeding this year. And you guys will see why in a minute. There's a few different species in here. TM Reptile. Cool, cool. That's my name. That is my name. And Reptiles is my game or something. I don't know. Okay, let's get into this. All right, so the first one we have... is a ready to breed proven adult female let me grab her tank and then i'll show you her i got her tank all ready to go so this girl is from crestopia um no lineage i believe just that it was produced by crestopia so um don't have lineage for this one but should be unrelated from everything else i have because i don't have any from crestopia all right here she is making quick observations now that head for a female i can work with i'm probably never going to breed a male with a head like that but for a female i can definitely work with that head um decent amount of spots pretty cute girl some red spots yeah very cool whoops hit the camera very pretty like I said, ready to breed too. So she'll probably be breeding for us this year. I'd like her to put on a little bit more weight though. But uh, yeah. Very cool color. All right, let me put her in her tank. All right, the next one we have hiding on us. 
already see some spots. Let's see what we have here. Hey, little buddy. Now this one is another Lockjaw Gary and Orb Weaver baby, but we already have two. If you guys have seen the other unboxings, you have already seen those. And we already have Damn Dottie, who's also a Lockjaw Gary baby, but her mom is stippling, not uh, Orb Weaver like these ones. Look at that, you guys. Oil spots are starting to come in, all those little spots. Very cute little gecko. I expect the glow up on this one to be pretty insane, to be honest with you. Very pretty gecko. Little jumpy thing. I'm trying to get all the different angles for you guys, cause I mean, I know it's probably hard to see on camera. Ooh, that's a good one. Very cute. All right, now let me put this one down and we will get on to the next one. Alrighty, so the next one, let me cover up the other one so you don't see them. So this one was part of a two pack I got and this one's lineage came from a giant reticulated um, gargoyle gecko. Couldn't think of the freaking name. But this one is very, very cute. Look at this little one. Oh my goodness. I did not think I was gonna like gargs as much as I do now after getting some, but honestly, they are pretty freaking cool. Yeah, this one's just tiny, using its tail to hang on. Very cute. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. What a cutie. Can you turn your head so you can look at the camera? The people want to see your face. All right, guys, let me put this one back and then I will grab the second part of our two pack of gargs. Obviously separate tanks, but um, bought them as a two-pack. So this was the littler one. Now let me grab the bigger one. So the next one is right here. I'm gonna hide that on you guys, but here's the next one. This one's a little bit bigger, obviously. You're supposed to be staying in your cup, buddy. I need to show the people. I need to show you off to the people. I can speak properly. Very pretty. Mm, I love gargs now. I'm telling you guys. Oh yeah, that's the thumbnail pick right there, people. But yeah, you guys, look how pretty this garg is. Obviously, you guys can tell I like the retic um, gargs because... They just look sweet. Anyway, this one looks like it's about to jump. I don't know where it's going to jump to, but it looks like it might jump. Very pretty, very, very pretty. All right, now let me put this one down and we have one more Gecko to unbox to show you guys. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I'm very, very excited for this next one and I had to just take a quick peek really quick and whoa, I have no words. I, I literally don't even know what to say about this one. But here goes. So this is the last one we have for today. Now you guys might be saying that is not a Dalmatian, but holy moly, look at that coverage. It's drippy. Oh my goodness. Ready to breed female. My goodness. Now, like I said, you guys might be saying that's not a Dalmatian. You don't really work with anything like that. You're right. I don't. But, 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 but if you remember a while back, I got daddy's money, which was a ready to breed male. And I've already had squash. So we're gonna make Squash, this girl who does not have a name, Squash and this girl um, being paired to Daddy's Money this year. So Daddy's Money is gonna make babies with this. And I'll show you guys lineage of Daddy's Money and I'll show you Daddy's Money so you guys can get an idea of what some of these babies might look like. The only, um, I guess you would say downfall would be there's a couple, oops, you're not supposed to be in there. You don't wanna go back and be shipped again. But like I said, the only downfall would be there's a couple Dalmatian spots. Now, it's not the end of the world. If she produces a bunch of babies with Dalmatian spots, um, I probably will move on from her. But, you know, we'll see. Very, very cute. I mean, this she's shocking in person. Like, it's, it's a lot harder to see how beautiful she is on camera. But, oh my goodness. She's gorgeous. 
like you guys i'm talking like structurally like look at that big old head color pattern like i said the only downfall to this girl is that she has a couple dalmatian spots but you know we'll see hopefully those don't get passed on but you know like i said we will see all right guys well i hope you enjoyed today's video like I said, I'm sorry that I took a little hiatus. I had to get a lot of things done. I got a lot of things put in place. So we are going to be doing a lot of, like a lot more videos. I shouldn't be taking as many breaks. I needed kind of a mental health break and I needed to get a few things in order. Um, again, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you should because I'm starting to post geckos on Instagram. I'm only posting my geckos on Instagram right now. I'm gonna do Morph Market eventually, but you know, that's a work in progress. So make sure you guys Follow me on Instagram and make sure you guys like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and some more farm content because we are going to be doing a lot more farm content. Um, I can't say too much right now, but we're going to be getting more than just... We're actually going to be having some farm content. Now, I'm not going to tell you what yet because it's not even finalized and a few other things have to, you know, line up or be... I don't, I don't know the right word. A few things still have to take place. Still few things have to be built oh nice catch so yeah just know there's gonna be a lot more farm content now you guys can try to guess what you think it is you probably won't guess it but i'm not going to tell you even if you do <laughs> but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to like subscribe shoot me a comment which one was your favorite and what do you guys think of the new ones hope you guys enjoyed the video i will see you guys in the next one fist bump okay see ya